Hello everyone welcomes to my sister wives today today channel, I hope everyone is having a wonderful day before starting the video please go ahead and hit the subscribe button and give this video a thumbs up. Xander Hitman Drama, Paulina's Surprise Surgery, Ava's Horror, and Wedding Doubts. According to spoilers for the upcoming two weeks, from February 5th to February 16th, on Days of Our Lives, several love stories will intensify and some shocking revelations from the past will occur. Abe Carver and Paulina Price will undoubtedly have some love advancements over the week of February 5th to 9th since they will eventually get back into BED.IT appears that Abe has grown closer to Paulina and more at ease with the concept of intimacy as a result of her cancer diagnosis. Even though Abe doesn't yet get his memories back, he will go to bed with Paulina and begin to feel even more like the husband he is. He will be caught between wanting to marry Chanel Dupree again and being worried by Chad DeMera's advice to keep her away from the Demeras after his breakup with Johnny DeMera. Regarding Ava Vitali and Stefan DeMera, it appears that they will come to an agreement to conceal their inebriated relationship. Naturally, Stefan and Ava's secret will eventually come to light, and that could end up being disastrous for Stefan and Gabby Hernandez DeMera's, Camila Banis's previous role, Marriage. Meanwhile, a drug bust will land Stefan in additional hot water, so E.J. DeMera will make fun of his brother and say that Stefan will soon be moving to Statesville to live with Gabby. There will be a climax in the tension between Chad and the person who eliminated Abigail DeMera when they arrive to interview Clyde Weston for The Spectator's upcoming story. Julie Williams will shower Thomas and Charlotte DeMera with extra affection as they enjoy a story and some quality time together. Thomas and Charlotte DeMera have been missing Abigail recently. As it happens, Constantine Melionis will also be sharing a story. It concerns Katharina, a woman, and something John did in Greece many years ago. John will be greatly troubled by what Constantine tells him even though he won't divulge all the information just yet. John will likewise enter a momentary obedient trance and assume the role of the pawn once more because of that scary red card, but after Constantine breaks him out of it, he won't recall. Steve Johnson will try to remove Constantine from the map before John finds out too much about his terrible past, but Constantine will ultimately decide on a cunning new scheme that centers around programmable John. Once Ava is back, she will meet Harris Michaels, Steve Burton, in secret and wind up having another hot encounter with him. Ava will have to work hard to resist Harris's attraction, but there will be more turmoil soon. Because of the cocaine bust, Harris will likely set Clyde off, which could result in Clyde giving the order to permanently remove Harris. It is true that Harris will be the target of terrible injuries from someone, but who will it be? When Xander Cook received a call regarding an elimination plan, he had no desire to take any action that would compromise his status as Victoria Horton Cook's father. Would Xander truly do this hitman job if it meant he didn't want to undo the progress he's made with Sarah Horton? If Sarah and Victoria are in danger, it's probable that Xander will take action to keep them safe, but it's also conceivable that Days is deceiving them in this instance. At the end, one of the DOL characters might try to eliminate Harris. Stephanie Johnson will confess to Kayla Johnson, across town, that she is falling in love with Everett once more. It turns out Stephanie might encourage Everett to take a risk by offering some guidance in the future. Even though Greg Vaughn's character Sloane Peterson Brady will long for some sensual alone time with Eric Brady, they might have to deal with more annoying interruptions. According to teasers for other days, Alex Kiriakis will meet Kristen DiMera, and the two of them will wind up sharing sympathy for Brady Black and Teresa Donovan's unbreakable bond. Tate Black will send Teresa and Brady some more letters, which they will compare to see how their son is truly doing at his juvenile rehab center. Teresa will connect with Alex more deeply as they talk about addicts and their challenges, even though she will feel herself drawn back into Brady. Fans of Days may also anticipate that Sarah and Xander will be more tempted than ever, possibly giving in to some passionate bedroom moments soon. Kate Roberts Brady will discover Lucas Horton sneaking out of Harris's place and become alarmed at the risk her son is taking. Paulina will discover that her surgery date has been pushed forward, therefore, she will receive assistance from Abe as she informs Johnny and Chanel of the development. If the surgery takes place too soon before Chanel and Johnny's planned wedding on Valentine's Day, there may be worries about the timing. Johnny and Chanel may offer to reschedule, but Paulina may reassure them that everything will be all right and she'll be there in style. It appears that Chanel and Johnny's wedding will proceed as a Valentine's Day wedding is scheduled to take place in Salem over the week of February 12th to 16th. But as Johnny moles on Chad's warning, he might start to feel uneasy. 
Is Johnny able to set aside his reservations and promise to adore Chanel for eternity? When Ava discovers Harris hurt and on the edge of losing consciousness, she will make sure he gets to a hospital as soon as possible. Harris will live to tell the tale since he isn't leaving the picture just yet. The geocaching scavenger hunt and other romantic surprises are scheduled for Valentine's Day. Eventually, Teresa will discover an engagement ring in Alex's pocket, which will completely upend her world. During the February sweeps, there will also be a fire at the Horton residence, which will add another mystery to the mix. The next two weeks on Days of Our Lives are expected to be very exciting, so make sure not to miss anything. Brady Black's true love Eric Martzolf interjects, according to spoilers for Days of Our Lives, Brady Black's love life isn't exactly flourishing right now, which makes perfect sense given everything he's going through. He doesn't really have time to think about romance because he is so consumed with worry over his son Tate Black's current legal issues and is still in shock after losing full-time custody of his daughter Rachel Black. In addition, he is drawn to both of his extravagant ex-girlfriends and is coping with them. This raises the question, who in Salem is Brady Black's true love? Day's spoilers seem to suggest that Brady and Teresa Donovan may get back together, but they also allude to something that may be happening between him and Kristen DiMera. After all, she had just changed her attitude about Mr. Black after he had informed her of everything regarding Tate. Eric Martzolf, an actor, recently chatted with Soaps.com. Brady and Teresa did become close throughout Tate's dilemma, as Eric admits. Given that feelings were running high over their son's problems and Teresa's relapse, it was only natural for them to become closer. Mr. Martzolf does, however, also comment on his relationship with Kristen. Even if they might not be a good fit, he observes that they always seem to find themselves in each other's orbits and says there is chemistry between the two. Eric continues by saying that the Crotties don't have the healthiest of loves and that their connection is built on manipulation. The subject of Brady's true love comes up later in the Soaps.com interview. Ten years ago, everyone might have been inclined to think Chloe Lane, but Martzolf says he has no idea who she could be. Brady, he says, has lost in love a number of times. The character had been engaged several times, but Eric points out that this was also a period when people got married whenever they felt like it. He has fallen in love with Ariana Hernandez, Teresa, Kristen, and Chloe. Madison James, Nicole Walker, and Melanie Jonas indicate that there is a pool of true love candidates. Eric is still apprehensive about Brady's greatest love and who he will finally choose. He did make the observation that Salem is a place where doors are constantly open. Maybe he gets back together with Teresa, Kristen, or another person from his history of relationships. However, it's possible that a new persona emerges to emerge as the love of his life. Who is Brady Black's greatest love, in your opinion? Post a remark in the space provided below.